Okay, today is the big day. If my Hogwarts letter doesn't come today, then I'm not going to Hogwarts. I didn't get in. But hopefully it came. Mom and Dad are home, so, you know, if I see them tonight, that means I'm not going. But hopefully I get to send them a letter by Owl later telling them that I got in to Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Please, please, please. Oh my gosh. <gasps> no way. Oh my gosh. Please be an acceptance letter. Please be an acceptance letter. Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. We are pleased to inform you that you have a place at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Please find and close a list of all necessary books and equipment. Term begins on the 1st of September. We await your owl by no later than the 31st of July. That's today. What do you mean the 31st of July? What? Okay, hold on. I need I need to take a look at this. Okay, I've got all my stuff. I've got the letter. I got my list of supplies I need. I got my ticket for the Hogwarts Express. I mean, 31st of July. That's literally today. I, I have to go now. There's nothing else for me to do. I have to head for Diagon Alley. Okay, um, you know, I can send Mom and Dad a letter by Owl. You know, once I'm already at Hogwarts, you know, I'm sure they're going to want to know what house I got sorted into. Has to be Ravenclaw or Slytherin or they're going to be disappointed in me. Oh, oh my gosh, I hope it's Slytherin, but it might be Ravenclaw. I don't know. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, I'm starting to worry that my letter would never come. Oh, oh look, there's the night bus. Okay, you know, I know that the night bus will take me where I need to go. It's always here to help young witches and wizards out. So let's see if he can take me to... I think I need to go to the Leafy Cauldron, if I'm not mistaken. Hmm. Welcome to the Night Bus, emergency transport for the stranded witcher wizard. My name is Stan Shunpike, and I will be your conductor this evening. Hmm. Whereabouts are you headed? Um, Diagon Alley is actually where I need to go. Hmm. Diagon Alley? That's in London. Huh. I'll drop you off in London, outside the Leafy Cauldron. That's a popular wizarding pub. Entrance to Diagon Alley is in the back. Perfect. Hmm. Okay, well, let's hmm. go ahead and go. I don't have much time. Here we are. Thank you so much, sir, for helping me. Hmm. Huh. All right, leaky cauldron, leaky cold. <gasps> there it is. All right, well, he said that the entrance to Diagon Alley is somewhere through the back, so let's just take a look around and see if we can't find our way around. Let's see. Oh, well, yep, this place is uh, definitely magical. No muggles will be wandering in here. Uh, could this be the way out? Nope, just looks like a broom closet. Oh, a broom closet with money. Don't mind if I do. Um, I mean, I guess I could actually take a proper look around since I haven't really seen Leaky Cauldron much before. Um, what's back here? Oh, the kitchen. I'm so sorry. <laughs> um, oh, maybe I could take a look upstairs. Oh, pardon me. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, look, there's some rooms. Oh, people staying, of course. I mean, it is an inn as well. There looks to be a lot of empty rooms, though. I wonder why no one's staying. Ooh. I mean, this place does look very, very nice. I think mother and father told me once that they stayed here a night. I would, wouldn't mind staying here. Oh, looks like they have some locked doors, though. Um, oh, a bathroom. Probably should have knocked before going in there. Hello? Yep, no one in here. Hmm. Let's see. More rooms. Wow, there really is no one staying. I mean, perhaps everyone's already checked out for the day, but I think that there would be more people staying here. This is a pretty popular place. Yep, nothing else around here. Let's see. A couple more floors. Jeez, how big is this place? It doesn't look that big from the outside. Um, yeah, just some random rooms. Oh, what's in here? Ooh. I hope people don't mind. I mean, people are just leaving their stuff laying around, so finders keepers, that's what I always say. Wow, okay, there doesn't seem to be much else to look at. I mean, everything... Oh, what's in here? 
Looks like somebody's office. Oh, money. I will have to buy school supplies today and, you know, I didn't really get to ask my parents for anything because they weren't home. That's what they get for going to the grocery store on the day my Hogwarts letter is supposed to arrive. Let's see, is there anything over here? Just a regular room, it looks like. All right, well, I've gotten sidetracked. I was supposed to try to find the entrance to Diagon Alley out back, but I should probably close this back. Don't want to be rude. Um, do I go back down this way? There we go. I sure do. Okay, let's try to find our way. Let's see, let's see. Out back. Perhaps this way. Is this out back? Oh, no, this is the broom closet. Hmm, I'm getting turned around. Out back. Oh, let's see. I think this looks like it's out back. Um, let's see. Oh, hello. Uh, do you think you could help me figure out how to get to Diagon Alley? Um, yeah, I need to pick up my school supplies there. Ah, a new Hogwarts student. Let me introduce myself. I'm Rubius Hagrid, keeper of keys and grounds at Hogwarts. Yeah. Diagon Alley's right behind that wall, you see. All you have to do to open it is tap that brick there. Perfectly easy. And when you enter, you should go to Gringotts Wizarding Bank and get some of that muggle money exchanged into our wizarding currency. Ain't no safer place, not one. Well, except perhaps Hogwarts. Run by goblins, speak to Griphook, he'll help you. Well, good luck, see you at Hogwarts. Thank you so much for the help. He just said to tap one of the bricks. Um, perhaps this one? Whoa. <gasps> We definitely don't have anything this magical at home. Even growing up with a witch and a wizard for parents. But it's just safe to pass through. It won't shut on me, will it? Alright, let's see. First things first, I do need to go and get some wizarding money. None of my regular muggle money that I spend in London will do me any good here. So let's go down to the bank and see if I can't get anything. <sighs> I hope I have enough. I know I need a wand. I need my robes. Probably a few books. Hopefully nothing else. I mean, I don't think I'm going to be able to get that much money with what I have, so... I'm just, you know, counting my luck. Wow, bank is massive. I mean, so is like everything. All these shops look amazing, but of course there's owls flying around. Witches and wizards love their owls, but let's see if we can't get some money. Let's see. Wow, I mean, it is ran by goblins. He wasn't kidding. Gringot sure is a peculiar place. Uh, let's see. You, sir. Can you help me? Um, I need money for my school supplies. How do you think this might come about? Um, I was hoping I could exchange my muggle money for some wizarding money, perhaps? Hmm. I see. Here, you have 250. That should be enough for your supplies. Now go. Hmm. Okay, I mean, goblins are, you know, kind of grumpy, but hey, at least I have my supplies money now. So I think first I should head to, I believe his name is Ollivander. I think I heard mom and dad talking about how they got their first wands from Ollivander's wand shop. Um, oh, here we go. Um, let's see. Makers of fine wands since <laughs> 382. Okay, that must be a joke. There's no way someone lives that long. Uh, hello, sir. Hmm. I'm here to purchase a wand. Hmm. You need a wand? Well, of course. We might have to try a few before we find the one for you. You see, those of us who studied wand lore know that the wand chooses the wizard. It's just not always clear as to why, you see. The best results always come when there's the strongest affinity between the wizard and the wand. Hmm. I've put aside a few wands I think might be suitable here in the shop. Can you find those for me? You need to look for three green wand boxes. Hmm. Um, alright. I mean, here's one right here. You know... 
for a wand shop owner, it's like your job. You're not very organized. Um, let's look in the back a little bit. Um, let's see. Oh, some money. Well, if you're going to make me look for my own wand, then I'm going to take it. Um, anything over here? Little wand, where are you? Down here? Uh, okay, definitely shouldn't go down there. It's a little too dark for that. Well, then the wand must be upstairs, I'm thinking. Let's see. Just need to find two more. Hopefully one of these wands works for me. Um, oh, I see one over there. Let's go get it. All right, little wand. You can't hide from me. And then I just need one more. Nope, that door's locked. Perhaps it's over here, maybe? Oh, there it is. Found it. Woohoo, I found all three. Oh my gosh, I hope one of these works for me. He will be the judge of that. Let's go and see. Well, I mean, I guess the wand will actually be the judge of that, but either way. Hmm. Uh, here are the wand hmm. boxes. Wonderful! You see, every Ollivander wand has a core of a magical, powerful substance. We use unicorn hairs, phoenix tail feathers, and the heartstrings of dragons. No two Ollivander wands are the same, just as no two unicorns, dragons, or phoenixes are quite the same. And of course, you will never get such good results with another wizard's wand. Hmm. Well, here we are. Try this, perhaps? It's a wand of birch. 15 inches, flexible and swishy with a unicorn hair core. No, I reckon not. Well, perhaps this? A wand of ivy. 13 inches, flexible with dragon heartstring. No, no. Definitely not. No matter. Hmm. Hmm, I wonder. Yes, of course. Hmm. A wand of rowan. Soft and pliable with a phoenix tail feather core. Aha! Perfect fit. Go on, give hmm. it a wave. Just, just give it a wave? Okay. I mean, I, I guess I can try. Um. Oh, I've... Yeah, I think I've got it. This works perfectly. Thank you so much. Oh, okay. Give it a wave. Ooh, and then some more money in here. Don't mind if I do. Sorry, Ollivander. <laughs> I guess we should be on our way now. Um, I think next we should go and try to get our books, I think. Yeah, why don't we go ahead and try to do that? Let's see. I need to find the store Flourish and Blots. Uh, I think this is it just right up ahead, actually. No, that's Herbology. Oh, I see it. I see it. Just a little bit further. The green store. Yes, we can get our books here. Let's go ahead and see. Hopefully they have all the right books that I need. Um, sir, please hmm. have the books I need. Welcome to Flourish and Blots. How could I help you? I need to purchase my school books, actually. Hmm. Oh, I've got them right here. Huh. All right, let's see. Uh, Fantastic Beasts, of course. Standard Book of Spells, of course, for beginners. Advanced Potion Making. I won't lie. Advanced kind of makes me nervous. <laughs> the Dark Forces, a guide to self-protection. Of course I need that. I need to learn how to protect myself. The Beginner's Guide to Transfiguration? Of course. Hmm. And I think that's all I need. Thank you huh. so much. Alright, well, oh, these are kind of heavy, but I got my school books, thankfully. I have my wand. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I think the only other thing I need is my robes. So let's go to Madame Malkin's robes for all occasions. Let's see. I believe that store was just down here. Hopefully they're not too expensive. I'd like to have some money left over. Let's go ahead and look. Um, hello, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Welcome to Madame Malkin's Robes for All Occasions. How can I help you? Uh, I need to purchase my school mm -hmm. uniform. Ah, Hogwarts. I've got the lot here. There's a young man being fitted up in the back room just now, in fact. Your robes will be magically colored the colors of your house after you are sorted. Mm. I've got your robes here. You can equip them by inspecting them in your inventory and selecting equip. Oh, thank you. Of course, we need the house robe. Of course, of course. Um, let's go ahead and purchase our scarf because it is a bit nippy out. And then, let's see. We have a few choices. We can either get the suspender trousers or the trousers with the belt. I think I'm going to go with the belt jeans. I think mm -hmm. that's all I need. Let's go ahead and see if we can't put them on. 
Uh, let's see. Yes, of course. Put back on the robe. And then we'll put on our trousers. Let's put them on over our clothes. Um, and then it is a bit cold out, so let's go ahead and put on our scarf as well. Alright, I think that's everything. We've absolutely gotten everything we need for school. I mean, I guess, you know, everyone's here, everyone's getting their supplies, and it looks like they're all going to school soon, so maybe I should just take, um, a head start and head to the train station. I mean, I was already nervous enough about receiving my letter literally the day of, so... Being a little early can't hurt anybody. I'll just go ahead and trek on over, and I'm sure there's already some other kids waiting over there too, so I guess we'll just go ahead and head on over to the train station. You know, I, I think I actually will miss London quite a bit whenever I'm at Hogwarts. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm excited, but you know, the Muggle world is mostly what I know. I know a lot of kids grow up in the wizarding world, but, you know, my parents did have me grow up in London. Of course, I was never hidden from the wizarding world, but... You know, this place has a special place in my heart. I think I'll always remember growing up in London, visiting Big Ben, the River Thames. And I can't even imagine some of the kids that have just lived in the wizarding world their whole life and they know nothing about this place. Oh look, there we are, the train station. Thankfully, I can see some other Hogwarts students outside, so... Oh, sorry birds, I didn't mean to scare you. We can go ahead and find our place. Hopefully we can make some friends. Hmm. Let's see. I need to find, I believe, platform nine and three quarters? There's platform nine. Um, platform nine, platform nine. I don't see a platform nine and three quarters, though. Look, these people think these people look like they know what they're doing. Let's see. Um, hi. Ooh. Hello, dear. First time at Hogwarts? Yeah, um, do you think you could tell me how to get onto the platform? Mm -hmm. Not to worry. All you have to do is walk straight at the barrier between platforms 9 and 10. Don't stop and don't be scared you'll crash into it. That's very important. Best do it at a bit of a run if you're nervous. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. Just run right in there into that wall? Alright, well, um... Here goes nothing. Whoa. Did I just phase through that wall like it was nothing? Okay, um, yep, here we are. Hogwarts Express, platform nine and three quarters. I guess she was right. Okay, well, these people kind of look, you know, a little intimidating. Everyone already has their friends. Um, this kid looks like he's all alone. Maybe we should talk to him. Hmm. Oh no, hello. My name is Neville Longbottom. Hmm. Um, I seem to have lost my toad Trevor. Can you help me look for him? Uh, sure. I, I think we have some time. I wouldn't want you to go to school without your toad. Hmm. Thanks a lot. I hope you find him. Maybe you can ask around in here if, in here if anyone else has seen him. Hmm. I'll do my best. Hopefully, I mean, I'm sure someone's seen him, Neville. Um... You know, I don't really want to bother people. Everyone looks kind of busy. But I do want to help him find his toad if I can. Um, let's see. Bad thing is, his toad could be anywhere. Oh, look, there's an owl up there. Literally, could even be under the train for all I know. Let's see, um... Trevor? Trevor the toad? Are you there? Um... I don't see him. Uh, Trevor, Trevor the Toad, maybe he's in here? No, but a remember all and some self-shuffling cards. This ought to keep me busy on the train. Uh, let's see. Um, you guys haven't seen a toad, have you? Toad, anybody? No toad, okay. Um, have you guys seen a toad? I'm looking for a toad. All right. I just want to help Neville find his toad. I wouldn't want him to be left all alone here. Uh, have, have you seen a toad anywhere? Hmm. Uh, yeah, I'm looking hmm. for a toad. I'm sure I heard a croaking noise coming from on top of the train. Hmm. On, on top of the train? There's no way. There's no way a toad would get on top of there, and I don't even know how to get up there. 
Um, here, let's see. Maybe if I go up here, I can see him. Toad. Oh, <gasps> there he is. I see him over there. All right, let's see if we can't jump up and get him. Oh no, this is not gonna work. I can already tell. Ooh. Oh, that hurts. Let's try again. Hopefully I can make this jump, get this toad, help out Neville. Oh, there we go, I made the jump. All right, another big jump. I'm coming for you. Thank God I got him. I don't, I mean, I know frogs can jump, but I don't know if he would have survived that fall all the way down. Neville! Neville, I have your toad. I'm never going to look for him again. You don't know how much trouble this little guy caused me. Oh, time to fall down. Oh, here you go. Oh, you found him. Thank you very much. I lose stuff all the time. No worries. Try not to lose him again, though. It's kind of gross. Sorry. No offense. Ugh. Um... I mean, I guess I could talk to the train conductor. I wonder if we have, like, assigned seats or anything? Uh, let's see. Hmm. All aboard! The Hogwarts Express will be leaving soon. Find a compartment on the train and we'll be off in no time. Well, if it's as simple as that, I guess I'll just go find a place to sit on the train. Um, let's see. Oh, that one looks full. Uh, he looks kind of weird. Oh, perfect. An empty car. I'll have peace and quiet. was a long ride to Hogwarts. Remind me to never take the train again. Alright, which way do I go out? This way? Um, I believe I can just travel over the bridge right here. Um, let's see, to get to the other side. Excuse me. Excuse me. Yeah, this looks like the right side. Alright, let's go see- oh, look! There's Hagrid! I'm sure he can tell us what to do. He's been helpful before. Hello, Hagrid. Hmm. All right there. Oh, I remember you from Diagon Alley. Hmm. Come on, follow me. Any more first years? Mind your step now. First years, follow me. You'll get your first set of Hogwarts in just a sec if you follow me to the boats. Hmm. All right, um, lead, lead hmm. the way. Oh, okay. Going this way? All right then, first hmm. years. Y'all get your first sight to Hogwarts in just a sec. Follow me to the boats. Alright. Oh, wow, this place even feels magical. Come on now, first years, don't be shy. Right then, this way to the boats. Come on now, follow me. Tis a beautiful sight, I tell you. I remember my first time seeing it. Oh, really? You went to school at Hogwarts too? Well, I guess I'm not surprised. I got sorted into Gryffindor, House of the Brave. Some folk even say the reckless. I mean, yeah, I guess you can't have bravery without a little bit of recklessness. Well, I suppose McGonagall will tell you about that stuff if you don't already know it. Oh, mm? look at ya. I hope you have a grand old time here at Hogwarts. Well, thank you. Mm. Better time than mine, I should say. A better time than you- Did you have a bad mm. time here? I had a bit of a mishap back in my day, so my, my education here was cut short, you see. I'm mm. so sorry. Well, best not get into that. And don't bother asking either. Alright, mm -hmm. don't worry, I won't. Thanks to Dumbledore, I'm still here mm -hmm. as the gatekeeper. He's a good man, Dumbledore, I tell ya. Mm -hmm. I've heard great things. Nearly there. Oh, I see the docks, of course. Well, hopefully I have a good time at Hogwarts. I mean, I am kind of nervous about, you know, the sorting hat. I don't know what it's going to put me into. But, um, you know, everything happens for a reason, and... It's just your Hogwarts house. It's not like it matters that much. It's just like the next however many years of your life. But, um, I mean, hopefully I don't get put into Hufflepuff. All I ask is no Hufflepuff, please. But, yeah, I just want to make my parents proud, you know? I want to become a good witch for them. Oh, all right. Looks like we're going to get on the boats now. Hmm. Well, now you better get in one of them boats and we'll be off to the castle. All right. Thank you again, Hagrid, for showing me the way. Oh, that boat looks good right there.
All right, well, I guess we're finally here. I should head towards the castle. Um, oh, thank you again, Hagrid, so much for everything. Let's see. Whoa, it's a long trek up there. Well, let's see. Hi. You know, Hogwarts has numerous charms and spells on and around it that make it impossible for a muggle to see. They see only ruins and several warnings of danger. Hmm, that's kind of sad, actually. I wish muggles could come to Hogwarts or at least know about it. I mean, I guess, you know, it does keep us safe for them not to know about it, though. Whoa. This place is huge. It, like, gets bigger and bigger the closer I get. Oh my goodness. Oh, hello. Did you know Hogwarts was founded by Godric Gryffindor, Helga Hufflepuff, Rowena Ravenclaw, and Salazar Slytherin? They founded each of the houses as well. Hmm, I guess that makes sense. I mean, I guess each house is named after their last name. Oh, bye-bye, little pigeons. I kind of like that there are pigeons here. It feels like London. Hmm. This is a great view of the castle. <laughs> At least if it isn't too foggy. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, it is a little foggy, but... It's nighttime, so I, I sh I'm sure we'll get a better view in the morning. Alright, wow, this is a really, really long trek. Mm. Can you believe Hogwarts is a thousand years old now? Generations of witches and wizards have been taught here. Mm. A thousand years this place has been standing? Gosh, are we sure it's not just going to break apart while we're in it? I mean, I guess it is held together by magic, but... Jeez, it's kind of, like, scary to think about. It's been here a thousand years. Oh my goodness, this place is amazing. Alright, well... Oh my gosh, I'm nervous, I'm nervous. <sighs> Hayden, you're gonna be okay. Just, you know, be true to yourself and you'll get sorted into the right house. Um... Oh. Mm -hmm. Welcome to Hogwarts. Oh, this must be Professor McGonagall. Mm-hmm. Now, in a few moments, you will pass through these doors and join your classmates. Mm. But, before you can take your seats, you must be sorted into your house. Mm -hmm. The houses are Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, and Slytherin. Mm -hmm. We're ready for you now. Follow me. Can you wait along here, please? Hmm. Welcome, welcome, to another year at hmm. Hogwarts. Let the sorting ceremony begin. Oh, do I have to? You guys don't want to go first? Okay, um, I guess I'll go first. Hello, Mr. Sorting Hat, sir. <laughs> Answer truthfully and I shall sort you into your house. All right. How would you like to be known to history? The wise, the good, the great, or the bold? Um, I, I guess the bold. What do you most value? Freedom, individuality, community, or ambition? I, I truly value my ambition. I believe that, you know, I, you know, I work hard. Which of the following would you most hate people to call you? Ordinary, ignorant, cowardly, or selfish? Probably ordinary. Given the choice, would you rather invent a potion that would guarantee you love, glory, wisdom, or power? Probably... Glory? A, a good life? Which of the following do you find most difficult to deal with? Punishment, loneliness, boredom, or being ignored? Probably being ignored. Which would you rather be? Trusted, liked, imitated, praised, envied, or feared? Um, praised? Let me think. I better put you in. Slytherin. Oh, thank God. Hmm. 
Let the feast begin. Oh my goodness. Thank God I was put in Slytherin. I mean, Ravenclaw would have been okay too. As long as it wasn't Hufflepuff, Gryffindor would have been eh. Well, I believe now the only thing to do is to go join my house. Kind of, you know, nervous, but... Look, I'm at Hogwarts now. I'm basically a true witch. I mean, this is where my journey begins, and this is where my path to becoming the greatest witch alive starts. Alright, I should go talk to the Prefect of Slytherin. Let's go on now. <laughs>